Hey everybody, it's your boy the Twiddler and I am back today with another uh, box opening. Now, this one is actually for Josh Fornelli. He bought this the other night. Uh, the other night would be Friday night. Uh, and we streamed so long that I didn't get a chance to open it, but it is for the bounty. So we are actually going to do a box break bounty right now for Josh Fornelli. Uh, so as you can see on the screen right now, we have 72 packs left. So if you guys are interested, obviously, I can do a box break for you. I can do a single break for you, or you can just come on to one of the lives and we can take care of you there. So um, it will do whatever you want. And as of right now, the bounty is at 12. We're going to open this one up and see if Josh hits any of the bounty stuff, uh, which is right here. You got an Elish Norn, Vraska, and a Mondrak. These particular numbers, the step and complete uh, borderless version. So it's got to be one of these in order to hit the bounty, which currently sits at one box now. Uh, pulls are 27 for one, 78 for three, uh, 150 for six, and 287, I'm sorry, 285 for a box. Uh, and then, of course, send over some shipping as well, or we'll just put it in a box that you currently have. So good luck, Josh. We're going to go ahead and crack this open for you right now, and then I'm going to post this for you to see. Uh, hopefully, I believe this is going to run on Tuesday night, so if you're seeing this, it should be uh, Tuesday evening, because uh, I will not be doing some lives uh, between now and I think the 21st is when I get back. So that will be uh, the 20th is when I get back. And the 21st is when I will be doing the next actual game. And keep in your mind now, the next actual game is going to be a collector pack pull game. All right. That's what I have planned right now. And I am going to put a uh, an actual video up for people to sign up by putting into, you know, the, the, uh, the comments. Uh, how many that they want, and to send over payment to lock in and secure those payments. Um, now, the pull pack game is going to include some, I've got some MH2 collectors coming, I've got some Commander Legends coming, I got some Zendikar Rising coming, and then I also have some double feature, uh, I'm sorry, double Masters 2022 in there. Now, there's not going to be a lot of that stuff, there's going to be the chase packs, and then there are going to be, of course, a lot of all the other packs in there. So I think we're going to have a blast. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Most people obviously uh, haven't been buying into things like that until the actual day of the battle, but that or not the battle, but the game. But that's okay. We'll take care of it then as well. If you don't feel comfortable doing it in advance, for those of you who have been coming to me for over a year now, uh, you know that I'll take care of you. So it's okay, no matter how we do it. So, all right, let's get started. We want to take care of Joshua right now. So good luck to you. Here is your first pack. Let's see what we can get for you. Uh, and if we can't get the actual uh, bounty to be hit as of yet, then let's go for some awesome cards. So let me go ahead and slide through here. We have got Mirex Borderless, Evolve Spinoderm, and the first step and complete is, is a rare. So we're looking at Vencer Corpse Puppet, not too bad. We'll definitely uh, get some of these things sleeved up. I'll go back through them and sleeve them up for you, Josh. No problem there. And let's get through these. See what else you got. You got Norn's Choir Master, Urbrask's Forge, and Green Sun's Twilight. And no Frexian Land. And that is pack number one. So that's how we're going to do it. Uh, easy enough. Josh, thank you so much once again for the support. Very cool of you. Uh, I will get these boxed up with the rest of your stuff. And for all of those who are wondering, I should have everything shipped out. No later for everybody before I go on vacation who has already paid for shipping. So if you guys are worried about me hanging on to stuff uh, until the 20th and you want to get it sooner and you haven't paid for shipping yet, please get some shipping over to me. If you have any questions about how much you have, email me right here at twiddlersplace at gmail.com. Email me and I'll let you know uh, what I have to ship to you, whether it's a box or if it's a, uh, or if I can fit it all into a bubble mailer. We'll make it work though. All right, there is Miglaw's Maze Crusher. Let's see, this is, it is an uncommon Canker Bloom. We got Bladed Ambassador, Sawblade Scamp, and then the rest of your rares are Containment Grafter, the Monumental Facade, and Seachrome Coast Foil. Very cool. And a non Frexian Land. That is pack number two. Let's go on to pack number three. Right. If, if you guys all have any questions, this should be uh, displaying currently on a premiere. So thank you so much for joining me. 
If you have any questions, obviously you can throw them down in the uh, the chat and uh, I will try to answer your questions as best as I can. Tyvar, that is your extended art. Thrun, and let's see what we got. And we got a common. This one is Rust Vine Cultivator along with Quicksilver Fisher and Bladed Ambassador. Uh, then we got Sky, uh, Sky Hunter Strike Force is your rare uh, Conduit of Worlds and Kaya. Intangible Slayer, that should be uh, about five bucks right there. We'll take care of that. We'll sleeve that up. All right, we got that one. Pack number four. Let's get this thing cracked open. As of right now, we have not hit the bounty. It has been reset because it was uh, won earlier by a one-pack snipe by a new guy, uh, Manuel Lay. Good guy. We'll have to uh, see if he swings around again. I think he swung in late the other night and was unable to uh, enjoy and join us. Venerated Rot Priest. I'll get that one sleeved up for you as well. Ovika, Enigma, Goliath, and what do we got here? We've got Quick Blade Fisher. Quick Blade Fisher. Let's see. Let's get through these. And Urtet will definitely have to sleeve that one up. Red Sun's Twilight and Dark Slick Shores Foil. And we have, there we go, nice Frexian Swamp for you. We'll put that off to the side over here. Okay, and uh, let's see. I, oh, and here's the rest of your cards right here. All right, pack number, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this should be pack number five. Uh, okay, so uh, any of those who are interested, obviously, uh, things like this, uh, you can come to my lives and purchase them, and I can do them on a private show like this, or uh, we can do it live uh, at that time. Obviously, when I do it on a private show like this, I can make a little bit of a video out of it. So Malkator, Purity Overseer. Let's see what's next. Tyrannus Rex, Tyrannax Rex. Drink him if you got him. There's your Mythic. That's very cool. All right, let's see what we got under here. And it is Mirror Convert. Mirror Convert is your next step and complete. So guys, everybody has been cracking open those complete bundles. They have been a blast. We uh, definitely opened one of our own here recently. And if you guys are interested, if you guys are um, members of 570 MTG on Facebook, uh, we're doing another giveaway over there for people who are invited to uh, 570's actual, um, to his actual group over there. So uh, if you're not in the group, get in the group and invite all the people that you can to be a part of the group because you get you get two ducks in a duck race for inviting people. And if they put their name in, I actually get one for inviting and one if they post your name, they have to tag you, all right? And then they get one for tagging you as well. So that's three ducks available, uh, two for you, one for the person that you invite, Kemba. See, so we got we got Sinu Dancer. Uh, it's a nice little giveaway, and it is for a free complete bundle. So if you guys are not a part of 570 MTG, I encourage you to head on over there and check it out. Uh, again, if you have not been, uh, if you're not a part of the group, go ahead and join the group and then invite your friends. Another Frexian land. And that is how, and if you know somebody in it, get somebody to invite you. And then you can do an invite, so and all your invites. So uh, you get one for being invited, but if you just join the group, you know. But anyways, <laughs> again, that's 570MTG over on Facebook. So uh, he's trying to build his group, and he does a lot for me, sending people my way. So I'm helping him out, and I'm probably going to do something of my own soon. That is Sheoldred the Apocalypse 436. Holy smokes, that's nice. Wow, and that is not one of them, but that's a badass hit right there. So there you go. We'll have to get that one. I'm going to have to scan that one and get you some uh, uh, some goodies on that. We'll get some get that, uh, you know, uh, protected for you so it doesn't get damaged. Mirex and Dragonwing Glider. Wow, very cool. So let's take a look at that again real quick. So that is, I don't want to touch it too much. That is... Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Shieldred the Apocalypse. Pretty sure that's what it says. <laughs> oh, very nice. Very nice. So let's uh, take a look at that real quick while we have a moment. So let me 
I'm going to look that one up. Take a, take a minute, guys. Go ahead and gasp and do all your commenting down below uh, on how awesome a hit that was while I am looking up the value of it. And we will continue on momentarily. That's the good thing about recording stuff because you, you really can do whatever you want and you can obviously edit out things if you actually have to do some editing. So, All right, Shieldred the Apocalypse. Let's see, what number is that? I say four. It is 436. 436. 93. 50. As of right now, it has gone up $6. So that is one of the few that are going and increasing in price. So congratulations, Joshua. That is an awesome hit. I'm going to go ahead and put it in a, uh, a tight sleeve and then I'm going to put it into... No, you know what? I'm going to put it in because it's going to go into a top loader. I'll put it in a good sleeve here. All right, there we go. And then we will put it into here. And I will get this shipped out to you in your shipment. Very cool. Very nice. Congratulations on that. Let's see if we can't if we, if we can't hit the bounty now or even hit another big one. So very cool. All right. So here we go. Back to pack number, I believe the one, two, three, four. This is pack number eight right here. We have Frexian Might, Bloated Contaminator. There is Atraxa Grand Unifier. You are killing it with this box already. So there you go. Attracts a grand unifier. Drink them if you got them. There's another mythic. Let's see what we got here. That is an uncommon. So we'll get that one sleeved up for you. Uh, we'll do that one later. Uh, unless we get another big hit. There's Wormquake, Tablet of Completion, and Nissa Ascended Animist. Drink them if you got them. There is another mythic. Holy smokes. And a Frexian land. So far, three Frexian lands. The average I've seen is half a box is Frexian. Half a box is not. So let's see what happens here. Wow, that is great. That's Shieldred. Surprised they don't have it on the list. Uh, back when the uh, when this was first released, these were the three highest cards, Elish, Norn, Vraska, and Mondrak. So that's uh, what we're holding it at, and that's what we've been running it at. There's uh, one. There's Luca, Bound to Ruin, another Mythic. Man, this box is loaded with Mythics too. So uh, let's see. All right, we got an Uncommon. Uncommon there. And Volshock Factory, the Mycosynth Gardens. I think that's still around 10 bucks, maybe higher. Graz Unstoppable uh, Juggernaut and an Island card. Man, 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 this is great. This is a great box so far. Let's get some more stuff for you. Let's get some more stuff for you. See if we can't make your money back. We're close. I mean, we've got 100 in already on the 285 price. Uh, plus the Mycosynth and a couple others. I think we're, what, about 150 in? At least, not including some of the other rares in here. O Ovika. And then we got Karamonix. And what do we got underneath here? It is a rare. That is Ovika Enigma Goliath. That is your next rare. Uh, your next step in complete rare, that is. Let's see what else we got here. We got Glissa's Retriever, Dragonwing Glider, and a Conduit of Worlds Foil. There we go. That makes four. So we're up to four with two packs left. So let's see what we got. Let's see if we can make you a uh, half and half going on here. All right, two more packs to hit the bounty. If not, then we will continue on with a 12-pack bounty thus far. Mercurial Spell Dancer, Graz Unstoppable Juggernaut, and we've got a common Sawblade Scamp. Lightbelly Rat, Sawblade Scamp, and Rux Hexbold Nabber. Hexbold Nabber, sorry. Venerator Rot Priest, a couple of those so far, and a Kaito Dancing Shadow. Foil, look at that. So it looks like we're going to get five max on the Frexian lands. So let's see what we've got here. We got Frexian Might, Thrunbreaker of Silence, Vincer Corpse Puppet, and what do we got last? It is Kethic Crucible Goliath. So we'll put that down here. Sawblade, Sinew Dancer, Staff of the Storyteller, Monument to Perfection, Skrelv's Hive is your foil, and we did get five. So thank God, we got five of those. So not too shabby. All right, guys, we're going to wind this up. Here are your big hits for this box. Yoldred, uh, The Apocalypse, Step and Complete, Atraxa, Nissa Animated Animist and Microsynth Gardens. Congratulations, Josh.
I will get with you on when this is going to post. And uh, we will see you uh, on the flip side, guys. Enjoy yourself. Have a great weekend, week, whatever we got going on. And we will go from there. All right. Take care, guys.